This is the 2014 Sea Chaser 170 center console. And let's start here in the aft with this Suzuki 90 four stroke. This is original to the boat, very low hour motor. And if I go right in front of that, you're gonna see the access point to all your aft workings, like fuel filter and whatnot. And if I move over here and open up, you're gonna see your batteries plus your battery switch. And now if we come down to the center compartment, you can see it's a very large compartment, great fish box slash storage. And you can see this owner keeps his fenders and you'll see your anchor light in there as well. And then if we open up on the port side, you're gonna see your live well. And then both on port and starboard, you're gonna see rod storage. And that brings us to a very large helm seat. And of course, this will, backrest will flip both ways so you can sit facing aft. And I just love what they do here. If you just open up here, you've got access to your cooler right below the seat and it's a huge Coleman cooler. And that brings us up to our helm and you're gonna see you got your Garmin GPS map 740S You've got a phone holder right there. You've got your gauges, your switches, your throttle, and then storage underneath. If we come to each side, you're gonna see rod holders. And then if we walk around, you've got your seat in front of the console. And if I go ahead and I lift up here and lift up here and you've got great storage of the drain and facing forward, you got a great fishing platform on the bow. And then if we go ahead and lift up, you've got large storage slash fish box and moving just a little bit more forward, you'll see great storage as well. And then if we move all the way to the bow, you're gonna see what looks like the setup for a trolling motor to be added. And now's the time of the video where I give a condition report and I name opportunities for the new owner to improve this boat. Um, looking around, it looks like just a great 17 bay boat Great to get uh, people out on the water, island hop, do some fishing and whatnot. Uh, the current owner just didn't have the ability to use it very much. They have some things going on and they just never got a chance to get in the rhythm to use it very often. So it mostly sat in high and dry and used sporadically. Uh, so it looks like it's got a nice package here. He's throwing in the life preservers. It's got a small anchor. Um, and it comes with a trailer, so he does have the complete package. And uh, in terms of opportunities for the new owner to improve this boat, this boat hasn't been detailed, so I imagine if you put a detail on it, it's really going to pop. Um, and then if I was looking around, I might adjust the bimini a little bit. They probably did it for height, have it adjusted this way where the, where the forward part is up so high. Um, so if you don't need the extra height, you could adjust the bimini a little bit. Um, it comes with a full cover, uh, so I think it's just a great little 17 package to get the family out on the water.